is how to play the game! That is an epic fucking intro, dude. And I have to warn everyone. Warning. What you may see right now is going to be absolutely disgusting. Sound good? Alright. That's... Sounds good to me. What's up with it? Vanilla face. Is he calling me white? <laughs> Why's it always gotta be about color and race? Huh? Why can't you insult me for my weight? Or insult me for bad facial hair? Or insult me because, you know, my jokes are bad? My gameplay's not fair? Why's it gotta be about race, man? It's not cool. Amazing says to her turns and says, Are we allowed to insult you for those things? Well, no. But I'm just saying, those things would be better than race. <laughs> of all the things you control, you're bad at games. That's my fault. You, you think my facial hair is shitty. Well, I technically shave and shape my facial hair. That's my fault. Um, You know, whatever. But my race, I can't help. You can't help your race, whatever race you are. I can't help what race I am. Why would you ever hold that against someone? Wow. Very, very, very hypocritical. King of hypocrisy. You were born that way, Stand you know? Up, wait for my girl. I had to send them a medical problem. Oh, you have a medical problem. Let's make fun of someone. The fuck? Do you think they want them? Do you, they were born with them or, you know, something they developed. They didn't do it themselves. That's fucked up to make fun of people for that kind of shit. Thanks to everyone who cheered some of the tip, though. I'm going to be honest with everyone. This is the slowest day I've had in about... Oh, my God. This just might be the slowest day I've had. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh my god. Oh, uh, I don't know what's going on. Listen, here's the bottom line, and I'm tired of it now. No more excuses, all right? Because the bottom line is people are like, Phil's not engaged in his commentary, and Phil's commentary is boring, and that's why people don't want to watch the playthroughs of the streams. Bullshit. I'm loving this game. I'm voice acting. I'm engaged. I'm commentating on everything that's going on actively. Bullshit. I call massive bullshit on any idiot who says that. I call complete and utter bullshit on anyone who's saying that I'm not engaged and I sound like I'm bored. I'm not. So, I've had enough excuses. It just seems to me like people are fucking lazy and don't want to come out to the streams. I don't even know what else to say, you know? I mean, this is kind of ridiculous. It's one thing if this were like an old game that I was playing it was boring and, you know, it was an older game most people didn't care about. It's a brand new game. And I can't even get 400 people on stream. I mean, it's ridiculous. I don't even have a thousand bits yet cheered. I don't even have $10 tip. Like, this is horrible. Whining, complaining. <laughs> Give me money, money. <laughs> okay. And this is exactly what I was afraid of with Kingdom Hearts, that if I kept playing it, that no one would show up to support, and look what happened. So I'm actually glad we're near the end of the game. This just really sucks, because I really need the help right now, with tips in particular, and this is the slowest stream I've seen in a million years, so hopefully things pick up. Keep in mind, I am doing Dark Souls later tonight as well. <clears throat> so hopefully, uh, you know, things will get better, but... I guess we'll see what happens, all right? Um, I need th that money. I really do. I need that money to pay my bills. Uh, I need that money to pay my bills. And if you want to see me continue to be successful and keep doing this for a living, you got to support in other ways. You know, whether it's watching the streams and cheering, subbing, and tipping while I'm here on Twitch or pledging to my Patreon or buying something for my Teespring, you know, m no matter what it might be. Um... I'm going to need that support right now more than ever. How's the sub count doing it? 513, that's what I got, right? Okay, so the sub count is accurate. So yeah, we've only got... I mean, this, we started at like 510, so I basically got three subs today. Three legit subs. <laughs> this is one of the worst streams I've ever done. So, seriously, hopefully I hope this picks up. Pledge today. You could pledge as much as you want. The highest perk level I'll give you is fifty dollars, but you could pledge more than that if you want. And I may be, I may be living month to month, paycheck to paycheck, begging for fucking tips and shit on stream for the rest of my life. 
and I love it. I love doing this for a living. That's the definition of a drama queen, seriously. The Phil Drama Show every day. Wednesday I'm off, and then Thursday you might say, well, what are you doing? Well, everyone seems to be going crazy for this Apex Legends game, which is hilarious because no one even knew the game existed until about a day ago. It is a new game from Respawn Entertainment, the same people that brought us Titanfall 1 and 2, those two marvelous duds that most people didn't play. Um, so it's a battle royal game, first-person shooter with classes, and the reason it's all the rage today is sadly because... Um, I hate to say sadly, but it is because top Twitch streamers were paid to play it. Do you show your toxic jealousy and just how petty you fucking are when you react to something like that? I mean, I'll be honest, just like any other normal human, yes, am I jealous of certain people and of people who are successful and whatever? Of course I am. Of course I'm going to have jealousy. That's a natural human emotion for those who have more than you. You're always going to have that natural kind of jealousy of those who maybe have, uh, you know, been more successful or things like that. They're all streaming it right now. It's the top uh, streamed game on Twitch because they were all paid to play it. You can even tell because in the corner of their streams it says Apex Partner. So they were all paid money to basically give free advertisement to a brand new game that's not even out yet, okay? Um, if anyone had known anything about this game, maybe I would have checked it out. But they decided to release it out of nowhere with a day's notice when I already had a schedule and everything laid out for the week. So... If you guys would actually like to see me play this game and try it out, say, Thursday, I'd be more than happy to do that. In fact, I'll make it my main gameplay stream on Thursday, where for four hours I'll try the different classes and we'll mess around with this thing <clears throat> and see if it's any good. But my question is, is anyone going to care by Thursday? Or is this just one of these flash-in-the-pan things where people care for a day or two because the top streamers are being paid to play it, and then after that no one cares anymore? Um, perfect example of this. Many games last year, including games like State of Decay 2, etc., all were hyper hyper popular on Twitch for two days, and then completely died and fell flat, and no one cared about them anymore, okay? So, let's see. If you guys want to see it for one stream on Thursday, and we'll see how it goes, I'll, I'm willing to do that, all right? So, I'll, I'll play it by ear. I'll see what you guys think tonight and tomorrow, see what feedback I get, and based on that, maybe I'll try it on Thursday and, and go from there, all right? FYI, as you guys can see from the tips goal, today's earlier Kingdom Hearts 3 stream is no exaggeration, was actually the worst stream, support-wise, that I've had in about two and a half years. I e-bag, right? You're constantly asking your viewers and your fans for contribution. Um, <laughs> and that's no exaggeration. It was that bad. Um, no one was doing anything to be supportive except for, I, I'm not gonna say no one. There were a small group of people. But in general, the support was just not there. And this is kind of what I was afraid of what was going to happen with, with Kingdom Hearts 3. Quite frankly, most people said, oh, I'm playing it myself and I'm going to watch Phil's playthrough on YouTube only. To which I said, well, that sucks because YouTube, I'm making no money on ads. I'm not. I'm making, like, nothing. Um, and basically, it's, it's turning out to be exactly like I thought it would, where this game uh, is not bringing in anyone to the streams and no one's being supportive. So, that being said, I hope some of you will consider being supportive tonight since I am doing Dark Souls, which is what many of you wanted to see. Um, I kind of need to make up for it, you know? If I, have, if I at all can tonight... It would be amazing if I could hit the tips goal. I don't know if I'm going to, but it would be great if we could at least get some progress because earlier today was absolutely awful, and right now I need your support a lot. Disgusting beggar. Uh, what I'm hoping for is the best. I'm hoping that we'll have some generous parties who will step up and contribute and help. Because I really need to try to afford to pay my freaking bills until uh, I get a big payment from Twitch later on this month. All right, so <laughs> please consider supporting tonight. You know, anything is appreciated. All right, anything. If you cheer and sub, that's going to help me out long term. But the best way you can help me tonight is if you tip me. That's going to directly help me this month to pay bills. Tips go right to my bank account. I can pay bills right now with them, okay? Padar is cheered. He said, have a three-way with Phil by supporting him in three ways. That's disgusting. That's absolutely disgusting, Padaris. Not appreciated. How could you be so gross? You know, males seem to be more attracted to myself and my content than females, Okay. I can't keep men off me. When I walk down the street, they keep grabbing my balls. You know how Donald Trump grabs women by the pussy? Well, men grab me by the balls. I'm out. I'm fully out of the closet, as you guys know. I'm out of the closet. <laughs> fully out of the closet. Yeah. I'm gay, I'm gay, I'm gay. Totally gay. You see what I mean? Like, I, I haven't played the game constantly. You say, oh, you played it for eight years. No, I didn't. I played the game twice. So I play, that's why your stupid comments like that are. You try to make it look like I'm dumb or something. No, you're the idiot. Because you act like I actually, all I've done is play Dark Souls for eight years. You're a moron. In reality, I play more of a variety of games than most people out there. So thanks for the tip, moron. Okay.
Let's go ahead and get him up on the leaderboard. Let's get the moron up there. He almost to got me toxic. He almost got me toxic. Saying, be honest, you don't really like Kingdom Hearts. You're only playing because it's a new release and you're not invested in the story. That's why the streams aren't doing good. There's plenty of people playing the game and doing fine on Twitch. Wrong. I like Kingdom Hearts 1 and 2. And the problem was, so many people played all the spinoffs. I don't really, you're right. I don't care about the story of all the other characters. I cared about the main storyline with the Disney stuff and that was it. Now I'm in the end game. I don't give a shit. But... No, the problem, reason people aren't showing up to the streams is very simple because they told me they're going to play the game themselves. They're 20-year fans of the series and they want to play the game and then come watch my streams or afterward. The thing is, they're probably playing it now, so they're going to be watching on YouTube, which sucks. Um, the people who you may be saying, oh, probably people playing it and doing fine on Twitch. Wrong. Not plenty of people. Probably a few people who are known for playing Kingdom Hearts and are into the lore and understand all of it. Probably they're the people who are doing fine. Not 100 million people playing a fucking JRPG on Twitch doing fine. You're an idiot. All you're getting is salt, 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 salt. It's, oh, even now, I'm getting my mouth overpowered with salt flavor. It's salty as fuck. It's like pure salt. All you could taste was salt. You couldn't taste anything else. Oniony, salty aftertaste in my mouth. And a liar, so there. But let's up the tips by two bucks. <laughs> I love just looking when people make shit up. Completely make shit up. Plenty of people. Oh, yeah, I'm sure there's like a thousand people playing the game on Twitch and getting thousands of views a day. You're an idiot. <laughs> uh, it basically, the stream was very toxic. All the Kingdom Hearts speedrunners are doing fine. Gee, I wonder why. <laughs> I wonder why. The people who specifically play play the game uh, and the game series are doing fine. Gee, I wonder. Just like the people... Oh, Phil, the hottest game on Twitch right now is Apex Legends. You should be playing it. It's the number one stream game on Twitch. And you go, look... Yeah, it's the number one stream game on Twitch because, like, the top five Twitch streamers are all getting paid to play it today. <laughs> so, of course it is. I mean, what? Stop being a gullible idiot. Use some independent fucking thought in your head every once in a while, for God's sakes. How's the gout, Phil? Oh, my God. Here's oh, another one. Thing. How's the gout, Phil? Oh. <laughs> another idiot. This is How's the gout? How's the gout? Who was it? Hold on. I got, now I have to freaking manually mute it. How's that Seattle Air, Phil? Yes, I want to play a game, yes. Alright, yes. you will. Don't worry, you will. I just gotta find out who this idiot is now. Say it again. No, say it again. Say, how's that gal? Go ahead. How's that Seattle Air? Come on, say it again. I mean, you're so dumb, I know you'll say it again. Say it. Say, how's that gal? <laughs> Come on. So with the gal, how's your daughter? <laughs> so the gal. He's still saying it! Let's <laughs> <Hold the> go! Let's <laughs> go! Let's go! Oh, Perry, let's go! Give me a cracker! Wow. What pasta do you prefer? I prefer a penne. Oh! Easy to eat. Oh! Phil's a faggot. Phil's fat. Phil's a loser. Phil's a beggar. Phil's a racist. Phil's a scammer. DSP is a pedophile. DSP is a thief. DSP is a greedy fuck. This on? guy's a bitch. I have a micro penis. <laughs> Alright, I'm not dead, but I swear to God, I wish I fucking was.